What is going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I have this sweet little, um, or what I would say easter egg, but it's more of like a secret room which you can go into and scan a few things within the tower. But before we get into the video guys, if you do enjoy it, leaving a like really does help me out and if you want to be in with a chance of winning one of my Rockstar Destiny 2 exclusive in-game gear codes, Simply drop a comment down below. So you want to load up the tower, the last city, the courtyard and fly down towards it. Okay, so we spawned into the tower. Now before we go any further guys, credit to this goes to a friend of mine, Wheelchair Dave, who was actually the one who showed me this. So once you spawn into the tower, you just want to head left and go towards where Cade is. You know, right in the far, far corner of this tower. This place is so big, it's unbelievable. It seriously is. There's so many hidden secrets here and this is just one of them, no doubt about it. So once you get down to this room here, the hangar, you want to travel under here. There you can see the dead orbit banners. Forget about that, go straight past there and you want to come up these stairs. You want to go around here and go up the stairs again. Just follow the path I am taking. It's actually relatively easy to get to um, along here. And then when we come to the end of these railings, what we do here is we have to jump onto these railings and get onto these wires. This part can be a bit tricky, but it's not too hard. Just walk along, jump up here, and you want to hug this wall as you walk around it, as close to it as you can possibly get. And then you want to jump onto there. Then you want to run around here, up here. And then we're going to some vents. Check this out. Check this out. And then we go up here, then we jump and we have to actually crouch to get through here, which is pretty cool. And here we have it guys. Now there's actually a thing to scan here, which I will go ahead and scan. Looks like a journal and a bray, but I can't tell who. Pretty much the entire thing is redacted and there are whole pages missing. Something about all this seems wrong. Am I worrying too much? So who is this Anna Bray? Now, Anna Bray was a hunter gunslinger and a member of the House of Bray. She was present at the Battle of the Twilight Gap. She wore the cloak strength of the pack. Her bracelet was found at Twilight Gap by a guardian investigating a time ripple on behalf of their future war cult. This is what Lord Shax has to say about her. You want another story about the Twilight Gap? Anna Bray the Hunter, we all dug deep that day. We all touched a light in ways we never thought we could or should. Anna though, when she fired the gun where her golden gun blast hit home, she left behind the pools of light like splashes of sunlight that burned and burned. So yes guys, a neat little hidden actual location within the tower. I'm guessing there's plenty more of these, I seriously do. Now later on down the line this may um, equate to something else, it may be a part of a hidden quest, who knows. But at least we know it is here now. And to get out of here guys, you can either follow the route you went, back through the vents, or you could jump out of this window, just like so. And there we go. So yes guys, another little hidden easter egg so to speak. Speak. hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did hit that like button really does help me out thanks as always for stopping by and i will see you on that next one